people who are first starting their business, that's the biggest problem they have. It's like, hey, you know what? I'm spending all this time blogging and I'm creating all this content, but nobody's seeing it. So You know why, Anthony? Because people have the wrong idea about what their blog is supposed to do, what their content is supposed to do. You know, People think that, oh, I'm going to be reaching my customers with my blog. And chances are you won't. But you could be reaching your advocates, right? Mm. And one advocate is worth 10 customers at least, right? Uh, so once you make that mental shift that I may not be speaking to my customers directly, I might, I might not, I don't know. It really, you know, there's, it's like blogs are like snowflakes. Everyone's different, right? Everyone's needs are different. But generally speaking, you're probably going to be speaking to your um, um, advocates, and often these may even be part, you know, partly your competition. It could be people in uh, related industries. Um, y- you know, it, it requires a significant mental shift to sort of. It requires businesses to become publishers, which is a huge shift, right? I mean, a plumber is not a publisher, but now uh, a plumber is required to be a pub- publisher in order to be found. You know, that's. Uh... I think I really like how you mentioned that because majority of my business comes from not direct traffic, but most of, like you said, an advocate of my right. business. They're like my fans or they refer business to me. Exactly. Um, and yeah, that's a really good, you know, message to the audience that, hey, you know, we're not trying to reach our customers, but we're just building, uh, you know, our tribe or our advocates. Advocates. Yeah. advocates. And, think uh, of it as a powerful. theater production. Yeah. Right? You're an actor on stage and you have some other actors on stage with you. Right? That's what your blog is. Your blog is a stage where various actors and you can interact. Right? But the audience is the one that pays the ticket. Right? The, uh, your audience, your customer will probably never share your stuff. They will probably never comment on your stuff. But when they come to the show, they want to see a show. They want to see interaction. They want to see shares because that's social proof. 